day three of the Great West Conference Tournament. Bronx and Northern Colorado. Bronx down one to nothing after three, but here in the fourth, base is loaded, and Riley Goulding hit by a pitch with two outs. That forces in the tying run one to one. Will Clausing is the next batter, and he lifts a single. That allows Irdir Hernandez to score behind Vinny Mejia, and the Bronx have a three to one lead. We move ahead to the fifth. Vinny Mejia at the plate, and he launches one to left field. A two run shot, his seventh of the season. And the Bronx at this point are within seven to five. On to the six, Bronx now down 10 to five. A wild pitch that allows Irdir Hernandez to come home and score from third. It's 10 to six. Later in the inning, Shane Klemke up with a runner on third, and he lifts a fly ball into the outfield. That allows Riley Goulding to come home and score. It's 10 to seven. On to the eighth, same score. Angel Labanias hits the grounder. Watch this, he beats it out. That extends the inning. That would have been out number three instead of run scores. And now here's Vinny Mejia. With two on, he lifts a fly Five ball deep to right, it hits off the top of the wall. That allows Derek Hagee and Angel Labanias to both score Mejia into second base with a two run double, game tied at 10. Next batter, Mike McCarthy, hits the grounder to short. Adam Hilker cannot do anything with it, E6. Mejia comes around from third and he scores the go ahead run. McCarthy advances to second on the play, it's 11-10. Next batter, there's Irdir Hernandez again. He comes up with another base hit, had a great tournament. Allows McCarthy to score from second, and the Bronx have a 12 to 10 lead. The next batter is pinch hitter Brandon Roush, and he follows suit. RBI single, Hernandez comes home and scores. The Bronx have a 13 to 10 lead, but the Bears get two in the bottom of the eighth and two in the bottom of the ninth. To knock out the Bronx, final score, 14 to 13. 